I have made some bad mistakes in my time, but that breaks, and I'll bet I've had way more fun than you. Well, hello there, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Bissolf Plays Minecraft. I am Bissolf, and this is me as I play Minecraft on single player worlds, the Minecat server, and the new private realm, Westside Punks. Not so new. I'll also be streaming on Twitch Monday through Friday, sometime around 8 p.m. Central Standard Time in the United States. Search for Bissolf Plays or click that link in the description below this video. If you have a moment, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, and if you're up to it, give a like or dislike on this video. And if you're feeling really adventurous, follow me on Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. And if you want to know what to do with Patreon, click on the link and it'll explain it to you. So, I'm getting the traveling bug again. It's been a whole day. Or something like that, I don't know. But, let's go this direction. We did come this way before, and we found that temple... And was coming home and got attacked by three zombie, well not zombie, but husk babies. And got killed like right over there. Well, we got killed right over, yeah, right somewhere in this area. We were standing way over there like dummies and didn't see our stuff laying over on the ground. So, we never really finished looking to see what was this direction. So, let's go look and see what is this direction. And see what's on the other side of this desert. Maybe we're going about this whole thing wrong and running the wrong ways. So somewhere along here should be that desert pyramid. Might have been over there. I don't remember. It's around here somewhere. But I'm going to kind of skirt this painted desert over here. Hmm, look. Free stuff. It's laying on the ground. Something must have despawned. Well, it's probably been sitting there since the last time we were in this area being held. I could have sworn it was right here, but I guess maybe it was over there. I don't know. Well, I don't see it now, so let's continue this direction. I'm really not wanting to cross any oceans, but I did bring a boat. And I'm hoping to find more grassland or savanna. I can find some horsies. Didn't bring any uh, saddles with me this time because I wasn't smart enough to remember them. So if we do find horses, we have to backtrack. Anyway, so let's go up here, and it looks like we are yes at an ocean, which I'm not going to deal with. I think we'll follow the edge and see if we can go back. And find another biome. I can't remember if we even went near swamps on the way here, so we're going to need some to make magma cream to get fire resistance potions. And I, the chances of getting magma cream. Oh, there's that desert temper. But the ch chances of getting magma cream from a magma cube is pretty low. You actually got better chances of finding a swamp, getting some uh, slime balls, I think that's what they're called, I can't remember, and then adding some um, blaze powder, I think that is, to it, and then the blaze powder and that react, and it becomes magma cream. Let's double check and make sure we did check out this, yeah we did, that's that tunnel I dug into it so that's good let's get out of here and let's continue going this direction I think we ran through the desert a little bit on the other side of this water at one point looking for something I forget what it was it's been a while but we'll see if we can find something up here other than that all we got is grinding to get experience and chance death, we need to do a lot of mining. We need a bunch of iron until we can get our diamond equipment. Oh, and the enchanting we do is going to probably be all books from now on because there's no sense enchanting the item if we can just use books. And then we'll use more enchantment experience to combine everything with a book. Or with an anvil using the book. 
So that's how we're going to make all our diamond equipment. There's no sense trying to, if we get enough diamond to make our equipment, there's no sense wasting it. Trying to put a decent enchant on it and end up with a vein of arthropods on our sword. Which we definitely don't want. So, let's see. Let's climb to the sand mountains. Not getting very far, are we? Maybe we'll find another temple. Who knows? It could even have a couple diamonds in it. Oh, and there's a mesa biome over there. Or not mesa, but a savanna biome over there. Which is cooler than ocean, because ocean sucks. We did find an ocean monument. While we were the second leg of the ocean I was going through, I cut out of the video. I don't care about it because we're not going back to it. There's nothing in there. You know, but all you get is those blocks of gold and some sponges, and I can't use either of those at this point. I need diamonds. So let's go over explore this area looking for horses. Maybe even another village. And if worse comes to worse, we'll enchant a bunch of armor and let's go back into the nether and search out for more chests. And see if we can find some more diamonds that way. I think it's going to probably be our best bet on diamond finding. Oops. That's a big hole. No horses over here. Lazy horses, why won't you spawn? Oh, there's some pumpkins we don't need. What else is over here? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Well, we won't bother going over there because probably no horses over there either, so. Let's go the quick route. We never did make a chicken farm, did we? Or egg farm. We'll use our boat. And we'll go out and around this desert a little bit. Kinda sorta going back the way we came when we first came into the world. It's somewhere over that direction. I can make a compass and show you, but don't have the resources for it, truthfully. If we can't find horses on this area, then we're not going to get them here because we have no way to lead them back. When I say the word lead, it means I have no leads. We can't make a lead without a slime ball, so it seems like swamps are our next thing on our list if we really want a horse. We could get through the game without it, but it would make all this running around a little easier. Let's throw this bed down. Okay. Pick it back up. Got that. So I'm thinking there isn't anything in this desert. Except for this. So I might run around a little while longer, but... I'm not seeing anything. And this will take me back over to the savannah we were in originally where we found that village. Where is it? What's that? There's another village, I think. I guess we ran on a big circle or something. I don't know, but that might be another village. I could have sworn I went through this area but one time before. Looking for horses. Huh. Nobody in there. Nobody in there. You do? What do you trade for? Oh, you're a shepherd. And you will be a farmer. 
You are a farmer also. Uh, no one in there. God, I thought I heard a horse, but I couldn't have. Oh, there's a fisherman and a cleric, of course. I'm looking for a cartographer. But I hope they're getting a map sometime soon. Eat another farmer. Nothing in there. No one in there. And another fisherman and a cleric. So nothing really good here. No blacksmith or anything. So I think I'm going to head back to the house. So that's it for this episode. I'll be doing my best to get a video out every day at 3 p.m. Central Standard Time, United States. And once again, thanks for watching. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. And if you're up to it, give a like or dislike on this video. Okay, don't forget to follow me on Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. And as always, later Minecraft Freaks.